Slat Tugwal. I'm the founder and the CEO of Apanali Sport Academy. Uh, UNSA was formed on 1st July uh, 2016. And the aim of it, we aim purposely because uh, uh, we want to bring these young boys together. And second to it also, uh, we aim at uh, trying to educate them because we have some programs. One, we have a sport, a sport uh, towardness talent at the early age. Uh, we have education to give awareness for all. Uh, we have psychosocial to build resilience for the community that are affected by war. Uh, based on the challenges that we are facing as currently now, uh, we don't have the, the balls, we, all the sport equipment, let me generalize, uh, generalize them, uh, to the well wishes. If there could be someone that can help, the little you have, and then can buy these boys and these young girls a shoe to wear. Also, we want bibs, we want uniforms, and we want cons. Uh, second to that, we also have another challenges on coaching. Uh, the, the, the coaches that are teaching at the moment, most of them are the people that are playing. Uh, we are trying to talk to them in a different way that we are trying to call them together so that at least they can teach a little bit. But the skills that they have really need to improve. Uh, that's why we also call out if there would be a training that can help these uh, people so that the skill that can have uh, could be a little bit uh, higher on the ground. My name is Majib Malia. I'm the coach for girls. I'm also uh, up and early sport uh, manager. Uh, what I need to address is all the challenges that we are facing here in the field with the girls. Uh, mostly we used to give them a training but uh, in the culture it's not allowed for the girls to play football. Uh, it's very difficult for us also to bring the, the, that culture of playing football to the girls to address to the families. Some girls they are not allowed to come and play it uh, but we have trying to manage uh, that issue. Shalom Kum, what shall I want? And book a rhyme a year no, and Yamal Tenokon Ching on Jacolaro. Hing that I got me done. Kangal Kurum or Guadan and two ways in bed, I went over. And Mindela, they learn the Mathiak. May ya bene, my yen and ever won our cook poor. I'm in good or good, not half. Go on, I mean, the little young dear, a gen. In King and Dermot, Yale, you got still a girl. Got the gen come on the king again. Cassa will be a letter. Oh, where we're gone. Colonel, ya, ya come upon ya. One make a room, I saw. Again, <laughs> I'm Galeroy Root, a project coordinator for Upper Nali Sport Academy. Since we started this, uh, we see some improvement in the community uh, that happened. Uh, we involve little boys and girls in our activities that really contribute a lot in, uh, in uh, the reduction of uh, uh, child abuses like uh, engaging them is into in, into micro businesses so we have really contributed by bringing these uh, small children uh, into a conducive environment where they have really learned how uh, to play well uh, they have also developed relationships uh, between themselves in which you can see there is no uh, conflicts that really uh, is, is rising in the community <laughs>
And on the other side, uh, for the, uh, the, the achievement that we have, as being uh, analyzed by my brother Halia, uh, we already have the unity among ourselves, even the boys, even the youths. Also, the other achievement that we did is also bringing including girls into sports. Actually, when we talked about the culture of South Sudan, it's very rare uh, for girls to play. But we try to talk to the community, try to talk to them and telling them that each and everything that boys can do, a girl can do better. And that's why they are playing right now. And it even in decreases uh, the, the pregnancy, most of them, because some them get pregnant at the early age. But now they get engaged. Most of them they are playing. And we have seen an, an achievement where they are being involved. They, can, they are flexible in a way that they can play. And later on at the evening they do house shows, which is something important. And we are seeing that this country needs all of us, need boys, need girls, need even young men. And that's why we use the sport. And because we believe that South Sudan to get peace is the only sport that we can use. And that's why even in the POC, in Rukona, in Bentiu Town, the crime has reduced a little bit because we are trying to teach them, tell them that this country needs you. And we need to make sure that the sports for South Sudan and even we are building a great team. We are building a kit that tomorrow will play for the national team. So uh, I would really appreciate this time. And we are seeing that at least there is a future brighter and forward. So thank you so much for that.